Hello and welcome to week two of the NPL finals, all thanks to Borrell, Chris Dittmar from Triple M, and with me this week, the man they call the Dancing Dorber, Matthew Dorber, how are you? Not bad, how are you, mate? How did you get the name Dancing Dorber? Tell us about it. Uh, When I score, I celebrate a bit too much, and I go for a few dances. (laughs) Right. Is that often, though? How often do you score? Uh, Last year I scored a lot, this year I haven't scored too much, but starting to bring the dancers back. All right, good. Well, just on that, you did score a cracker at the weekend. Let's have a look at this goal for Metro Stars. Now, just run us through the goal. Tell us about it. Uh, I'm playing right wing, yep. took a good touch and inside, um, everyone thinks I'm crossing the ball, but yep. I had a good shot with my left foot and it went top corner, so you can't complain. Alright, now tell the truth then, were you crossing it? Was it a pass or did you <laughs> mean to score? Well, I'm the right wing and I'm playing on the left side because right. I'm a bit greedy, wanted the goal. <laughs> uh, at 3-0 uh, up, you want to score, so yep. yeah, come across, and took a good touch and then yeah, hit the ball. Well done. Now, to start the final series, a 4-0 win against Raiders, that's, that's fantastic. You boys have to be super confident. Yeah, well, the last four or five weeks have been building and this week ticked another box off with Raiders and now hopefully go to this week's game with the Olympic and yep. yeah, tick another box there and keep going. All right, how'd you go with Olympic when you played them this year? Uh, not the greatest. Uh, they've been a bit of a bogey side for us, but we're pretty confident on the track the last few weeks that yep. you know we can do the job, so that's the, that's the aim there. Is there anything in particular that you've felt? What's, what's turned your form around? Because Metro, you were kind of mid-table most of the year. Have you, have you seen anything? Have you noticed anything in particular that has changed it? Uh, enjoyment factors back at training, yeah. so yeah, like when you're enjoying your workplace, yeah. whatever it is, um, you, you perform better, so yeah. yeah, we're enjoying our, our soccer again, which is good to see, and the results are showing on yeah. the weekend. So. Now, I was lucky enough to see the other game on the weekend, Campbelltown and Collins. I've got to tell yeah. you, very even game, and, and in the end, it was an Alan Welsh header that separated the two teams, but it really could have been nil-nil, could have been one all, it was such a close game, but you and I were talking before, how tight are all of these teams that are left in it? Oh. It's a great competition, isn't yeah. it? So you got eight, nine teams that were good this year. They were around the mark, and luckily we snuck in there in the sixth spot, and hopefully we can go all the way. But yeah, it's such a good competition this year. Yeah. All right. Now, from your experience, and we don't want to talk Olympic down at all because they're very, very worthy opponents. But they've had to play midweek, yeah. and they unfortunately lost in the FFA Cup. Uh, do you expect them to be heavy in the legs, or I mean, can the modern footballer put up with three? They have to play last weekend, Wednesday night, and then of course against you Saturday. Yeah, well, they went extra time on the weekend, so yeah. They played an extra 120 minutes. Do you think that's going to come into it? Uh, it might do, it might not. They'll be prepared. They're a professional outfit like we are, so they, they'll do the job and they'll be up for the fight on Sunday yep. night. So Now, tell me a bit about um, your background. Where did you start your football? Uh, I played at St Augustine's as a junior in the Lisbon Districts. Uh, then I moved to Adelaide City, went to Blue Eagles, and then left Metro stuff. Yeah, right. And big soccer family or football family. Your yeah. sister, your sister's going very yeah. well. So. Yeah, she's a gun. She scored 40 goals, I think, this year. 40? Yeah, her boots just broke, so she's devastated. She wants to wrap them up. <laughs> just to, uh, right. They're the, the boots. lucky boots. Yeah, exactly yeah. right. Yeah, All right. So. Now, is she a dancing dauber as well? No, nah, her celebrations are boring because she scores too much. She just gives <laughs> right. high fives. No worries. Uh, that's this, is that right? Yeah. Uh, mate, great to meet you. Thanks Cheers for coming in, and no good worries. luck on the weekend. Uh, Metro Stars are doing great things at the moment, and enjoy your weekend at the football all thanks to Borrell.